today a little bit on how to overcome stress and anxiety on the golf course. Now we've all been on the driving range before with our basket of balls hitting shot after shot, feeling great. Hitting those balls to the 250 marker, thinking we're going to be the next Tiger Woods. Um, but something happens when we get out on the golf course, it's almost like a void between us and the ball. And we start thinking about it too. We start sort of thinking about the negative aspects of the hole. Maybe the pond on the right hand side that's drawing us in. Or maybe we're thinking about the last time we played this hole and we went out to bounds down the left. It's very negative, especially before you're about to hit your shot. One thing good players do is to have a very good pre shot routine, and that enables them to get focused before they hit their shot. One of the techniques I used, it was before I turned professional, and I, I used this technique in a competition. I actually won the competition. I'm going to talk about that in a moment. But first of all, I'm going to sort of talk a little bit about how the brain works. I'm going to simplify it. We're going to call one side of the brain self one, and the other one self two. Now, self one is all the commentary that you have in your mind just before you hit your shot. All the negative thinking that we just talked about earlier on. All the the sort of about the pond, about the, the sort of the trees down the left, the, all the, the aspects we don't want to do. Maybe you, you may have topped the shot after the last round or the last hole that you played, and you're sort of thinking, oh, I don't want to top it, and then you end up sort of chopping into it when you hit your shot. We don't want that. So that's self one. Self two is your natural ability. Now you've all got natural ability. You've all hit your your shots on the course or on the driving range and thought, wow, that's fantastic. That's what made you made you come back. And really, when you when you hit those shots, you're not really thinking about anything. You're nice and relaxed. Swing feels really easy, and uh, you know you let your natural ability to produce the, the good shot that you, you hit. So we've got to try and quiet self one down and let self two do its job. Now the technique I used was called the back hit technique. Dead simple, I used it for all the shots that I played during the round and I, I shot sort of two under par and won the tournament. Um, basically I'll do it as a practice swing first and all we do, top of our back swing, say back and then when we hit our shot we say hit. So it goes something like this, back hit. Okay? What that does, it takes, it, it, your mind it stops any negative thoughts stops any tightness in your swing as well i'm going to give it a go now i'll do my routine have a little practice swing first okay let's stand behind the ball the reason i stand behind the ball is i'm trying to get my sort of i get my now that's my trigger sort of i once i've got my hands on the club here i'm focused i'm in the zone i'm going to walk up to the golf ball looking at my target behind the ball, good aim, good setup, in my head, back, uh, that's pretty good, I take that every day of the week. So, go out and try it, you know, just uh, even with putting, I used mine with putting and it really, really helped with that as well and uh, it takes away the negative thought, quiet and self one down, let self two do its job. Okay, I hope you've enjoyed the video. If you have, click the like button. You can subscribe to my channel. You can follow me on Facebook. You can like me on Twitter. No, you can't. <laughs> you can subscribe to my channel. You can follow me on Facebook. You can subscribe to my channel. You can follow me on Twitter. You can like me on Facebook. My name is Tony Johnston from TJ Golf at the Academy at Staining Lodge. Thank you very much for watching. I will see you again soon.